Knoxville Mayor Madeline Rojero gave her final State of the City address today. She leaves office in December. She highlighted a gateway to the urban wilderness in South Knoxville, expanding greenways across the city and moving the Knoxville Police Department to the old St. Mary's Hospital in North Knoxville. She also shed new light on when we could see a baseball team back in Knoxville. 10 News reporter Mark Salinger joins us with those plans. Mark. John, don't break out the baseball mitt just yet, but Mayor Rajero says all the pieces are in place to see the Smokies maybe one day soon moving here to Knoxville. Rajero says the, the move likely won't happen in the next eight months while she is still mayor, but she wants to leave everything ready for the next person who takes office. Rajero says the city has purposefully reserved funds over the past year with, with bringing the team to Knoxville in mind. Again, she says a lot of the pieces are already in place to see the team move. We have been working with the management of the Smokies for months now with the goal of returning the team to Knoxville. The team owner has secured land and invested resources in creating preliminary designs and layouts of a ballpark on the eastern edge of the old city. Rahero gave her speech today at the end of James White Parkway. Crews will soon break ground on a gateway park project at that site. There will be an entrance to the urban wilderness. There will also be a greenway extension over the South Knoxville Bridge that will connect downtown with a bike and walking path. Robin and John. We'll $10 million dollar investment. Yeah, Mark, thanks very much with her priorities.